new regulation to implement reductions in greenhouse gas emissions in the power sector in Latin America varies by country. For example, Chile's Ministry of Energy has set a goal of 80% renewable energy generation by 2030 and 100% by 2050 pursuant to its decarbonization plan. Combating climate change is a linchpin in Chile's energy policy, which incorporates green hydrogen and electric mobility as opportunities to reduce emissions in the country's principal productive sectors. Renewable power auctions have been implemented successfully for several years in Chile and Brazil, and more recently in other countries like Colombia and Ecuador. Beyond auctions, Chile has attracted investment in its special PMDD distributed generation scheme. In Brazil, free market renewable PPAs and self-production regimes appear to be trends, and we hope that cross-border financings supported by dollar-denominated PPAs can help foster the development of a potentially larger renewable energy market. There is a great need for investments in power grid growth and stabilization projects across Latin America, particularly in transmission networks, to support the growing number of renewable generation facilities. In the medium term, gas to power projects will likely be needed to cover baseload requirements. In addition, Decreasing costs of technology and need for improvements in grid reliability should provide interesting opportunities in large-scale storage. <laughs>